A driver was shot twice and crashed, hitting several cars before flipping and coming to rest on top of a car in North Harris County just after midnight. Deputies say the occupants of the pickup were at a car meet at the Home Depot parking lot on East Tex in Little York. The men in the pickup left and entered the freeway northbound, unknown if they were racing or being chased, but speeds exceeded 100 miles per hour before they exited onto the feeder before the crashes. The pickup then struck numerous parked vehicles in the parking lot before coming to rest on the top of a vehicle. One person was extricated from the pickup, was found to have two gunshot wounds. He is not expected to survive. We had a black Chevrolet pickup truck that was traveling at a high rate of speed, exited the East Tex Freeway northbound, uh, lost control of the truck. It left the roadway at the East Tex uh, coll collision uh, business uh, on the northbound feeder. It entered the parking lot of the uh, collision center, uh, traveled about 300 feet, striking at least four vehicles, where it eventually ended up uh, upside down on top of another vehicle uh, by a storage container. There were two occupants of the vehicle, uh, a passenger that was located, and then the driver was still inside the vehicle. He was transported by ambulance to a local hospital where they determined that he had suffered two gunshot wounds. Uh, our violent crimes unit initially responded to the scene uh, based on the injuries. Uh, they did not expect the driver to survive his injuries, and so it was referred over to the homicide unit. From what the witness is telling us, who was a passenger in the vehicle, they were at a car rally at Little York in the East Texas Freeway in the Home Depot parking lot. They had just left that area when they were involved in a altercation with a red four-door sedan believed to be a Ford. Uh, and after they left that, uh, we have witnesses said that the black truck and the red vehicle were traveling in excess of 100 miles an hour northbound on the East Texas Freeway.